A scare this morning at Omaha South High School and schools across Nebraska. It may have been a hoax, but it caused real emotion. 3 News Now reporter Ron Johnson has more from South Omaha. A much calmer scene here at South High School in South Omaha. Kids outside the school now coming out after a massive police presence here earlier this Thursday morning. It started just after 8:15. Dispatch received a call of a shooting at South High School. Omaha police swarming South High, the school going into lockdown. Students inside. I don't know where we just had like the lockdown drill going and stuff like that. And you know, the first thing we did was just go to like where we we're supposed to go and hide. Many of them texting their parents who then rushed to the scene. Started to worry, you know, got in the car, drove here and like all the other parents, it was a, a lot of traffic. I couldn't get around because there were so many cars, so it was hard for me to come in and park. And, you know, there was a lot of cops everywhere, so that scared me when I hit the corner and I seen all the cop cars, and it was like, it's something serious. Police searched the building, finding no evidence of a shooting, determining all of this was started by a prank call. Anyone involved in this, you know, should, should also know that uh, there are criminal charges they could face for making a call like this. The threat may have been fake, but the fear for parents and students was anything but. Mateo Dominguez remembers sending a message to his mom. So I remember just telling her, you know, I love her and just, you know, that's like the only really thing that I really cared about in the moment was making sure that she knows that, you know, I was grateful for her and that, you know, I'm glad for everything she did. As the scene cleared, parents and kids were just happy everyone was safe. Many taking the rest of the day off to decompress. Let them, you know, recover at home and just talk things out. In South Omaha, Ron Johnson, 3 News Now. In a letter sent to parents, the school's principal says safety protocols were followed and everyone is safe. They say counselors will be on hand for students or staff who need to talk, but that's not where the story ends. The Nebraska State Patrol says they've had several false 911 calls of school shootings today. They say there is no credible information that any of these calls are legitimate. Earlier this week, the Nebraska Information Analysis Center issued a bulletin about a trend of swatting calls in other states. NSP says whoever's responsible today is guilty of a crime. We have text messages being sent to parents. I'm afraid. We have students and teachers barricading doors and locking doors. These are the appropriate responses, but the fear and trauma that is resulted from this criminal action is almost incomprehensible. Investigators say there are similarities in calls with other states, like the technology used to mask the caller's identity and location, using or mocking a foreign accent, mispronouncing school or town names, and pretending they're hiding inside the school. Anyone with information is urged to call 888-580-6422 or submit a tip online at sars.nebraska.gov.